President Bola Tinubu has assented the Northwestern South East Development Commission bills into law, thereby setting the stage for the establishment of the two interventionist agencies to address development challenges in the Northwest and Southeast parts of the country, respectively. Following years of insecurity, the Deputy President of the Senate and sponsor of the Northwest Development Commission bill, Senator Jubrim Barau, disclosed that the presidential assent to the bill during or disclosed the presidential assent to the bill during a chat with journalists in Abuja on Tuesday night. Expressing his happiness on the presidential assent to the bill, the Deputy President of the Senate, in a media chat with journalists, said the commission, when established, would help to drive development across the seven states in the Northwest Zone. Appreciation and the appreciation of the entire people of the Northwest Geopolitical Zone. Um, the fact that the president today signed uh, the Northwest Development Commission bill, uh, he signed into law, and so uh, he has brought to life the Northwest Development Commission, uh, which is a body commission that is going to assist in the development of uh, Northwest Jokuzu. Uh, this is something that uh, for today is one of the happiest days of my life uh, because I sponsored the bill and it has been a, I have been praying that uh, this commission should be established so as to help Similarly, Deputy Speaker of the House of Representatives, Right Honorable Benjamin Okeze Kalu, has expressed what he called an extravagant gratitude to the President Bola Tinubu for signing the Southeast Development Commission SEDC bill into law, thereby approving the creation of the Interventionist Commission. The bill sought to establish a commission that will be charged with the responsibility to receive and manage funds from a location of the Federation account for the reconstruction and rehabilitation of roads, houses, and other infrastructural damage suffered by the re region as a result of the effect of the civil war after 54 years. The Commission will as well tackle the ecological problems and any other related environmental or developmental challenges in the southeast states, which include Abia, Imo, Enugu, Anambra, and Ebonyi. Reacting to the cherry news in a statement by his Chief Press Secretary, Mr. Libenus Nwabugyo, Nwabu Gyogu, late Tuesday night, the elated Kalu thanked President Tinubu, his colleagues in the National Assembly, and indeed all Nigerians for supporting the bill. It's a testimony, it's a demonstration that uh, it's a leader to trust. It's a leader that has uh, love of his people in his heart. What we need to do is to be patient. Rome was not building a day. Uh, Rome was not building a day. For someone to do this, you know that person has a leader, the president of the country, to look at the plight of his people and decide to take this kind of uh, um, action to give his assent. So this kind of really shows that he's a leader that has uh, the love of his people in his heart. So let's continue to pray for Mr. President, to pray for our country, and to give him the support. And let us be patient. It's not an easy thing to build a country. And, uh, when we try to be in the haste, then we begin to make a mistake. This is first year. He has just done one year in government. And he's starting to roll out this kind of uh, wonderful uh, initiatives. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.